So, uh, <laughs> actually, just leaving. Uh, Rides. This butt guy behind us. Wave. <laughs> hey, he's getting into the spirit of things. That's great. So, uh, Chalk Van Shake is is paying because she's got the uh, she's got the Buttersville purse. And uh, we're going going outside, John and me, just to wait. I must find an ATM. Yeah, to find an ATM. Because uh, because you know we need money. Money. And uh. I got myself a little souvenir of our, <laughs> of our trip to Rhines. Oh my. Hang on. That's a policy cover, isn't it? It is. What? <laughs> yeah. Let's interview it. Let's interview it. Okay. <laughs> Do you have any questions for this toilet seat cover? Yeah, like, so what inspired you to become a toilet seat cover? <laughs> oh, come on, it's a family <laughs> show. You can't say that. <laughs> He's a toilet seat cover. What do you expect him to say? Yeah, I suppose. Yeah. I mean, you know, he's if, he, if if anybody's gonna talk shit, it's gonna be a toilet seat cover. Yeah, you know, I know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, so what, what you got there, John? I've got an actual halva bar, which is the I swear to God, this place is the only place I've been able to find these things. And I believe me, I've looked around for them. That's a hell of a halva bar. Hell of a halva bar. It's like it's ground basically it's ground sesame seeds with a chocolate coating. But it's really rich and it's really good. It, it's expensive too, though. That's the thing. Sounds vomit inducing. Yeah. Well, you know, depends. So anyway, um, so we're, we're also going to walk by the worst record store in the world. <laughs> Let's go there um, first. They call themselves the record store, well, the good, the, the good I can one. See it behind that tree. And uh, they claim to have, uh, they claim to be a really good record store. Oh boy. We're going to check that out. We're going to put it to the test. And you're going to the join us test. for the ride. The butter test. If it doesn't pass the butter test, then it ain't no good. <laughs> right, toilet seat cover? <laughs> He's got that right. I mean, oh boy. You know, so anyway, uh, so, we, you know, we like to come here like pretty much every time we uh, we visit. This little this little storefront. This was a, this was, a, this was, this was a like the Republic headquarters. campaign headquarters for for the Republican Party, and as you can see, it's real busy. It's real busy. It's like Donald 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 Trump, Donald Trump just bought this building, and uh, he's he's, oh, he's gonna be he's gonna be selling uh, toupees. Donald Trump bought every building. He did. He, he it's a it's a it's a it's Trumperific. <laughs> Trumperific. Oh boy. Trumperific. Trump horrific. Trump horrific. Because he's going to be the most awesome president ever. <laughs> Trump horrific. All right, you, you got to just take a look at this at, at this at this place. We're just going to look at it from the outside. Okay. Come on. Come on. Look at that. And that is a real record store. Yeah, real record store. No one does. Actual Look mother. at that guy's hairdo. That's crazy. Although I should talk because I got a crazy hairdo too. <laughs> but like the last time we were here, they were charging like $35 for a Bob Dylan LP that you can buy pretty much anywhere for 10 bucks. And uh, and they were kind even of that's kind of a, even that's kind of high. Yeah, I mean it was it was it was like this beat up record. It was falling apart, and they wanted 45 bucks for it. What if I scan the CDs for a second? We got kind of blue. Yeah. It's hanging in the window. Right. You can't buy it because it's hanging in the window. Anyway, we're going to go in. We'll give you a full report in just a few seconds.